But okay. she's a little opener. Um, I was talking to my friend literally the other day. I'm not going to mention her name or his name because I don't want people to realize this. But uh, you take a shower every morning, correct? You know me. Good. Okay. Now, the drying towel. You hang it up? Now I do. Hang it up. Yeah. You might use it again later. You yeah. might use I, that drying towel I had to teach myself later. how to do that. Here's you know how I, we grew up. But here's what I found out. I'm sitting amongst a group of friends, and here's what I found out. The washcloth. What do you do with that? Okay. I use a different one. You know how we- Okay, okay. But we're brothers. But I use a different one every day. You use a different one. I didn't know that people were recycling the washcloth. Yeah. That's brand new to me. Like brand new information. I tried that when we moved out of our parents' house. I tried to reuse it. It's different. No, bro. Like like Plus, I mean, I feel like it's just- I don't like it. It's different for like certain things that you do in life. We're dudes. You might go running. You might do some stuff. And it has nothing to do with the dude. It's just all, all disgusting. All right, fine. You're Look, a dude. You might have a shitty day. Our friends who listen to this podcast, I just want y'all to know right now that in that moment, I was disgusted yeah. by y'all. I'm still disgusted by y'all. I thought I voiced how disgusted I was by y'all, but it's been on my heart because they told me that two weeks ago. Yeah. And like this morning, I woke up and I was like, Ugh. Bothered me. You ever so, gone, yeah. to, you ever gone yeah. and, and took a shower at somebody's house and you see the the towels hanging up? You'd be like, okay. Yeah. <laughs> like, <laughs> that's what I got myself into? That's <sighs> whatever. Yeah. 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 Ugh, it's disgusting. Like how, like how everybody's treating the Astros because we oh, cheated. Yeah, we cheated. We're heels now. We won. It does. I don't care. I like being the bad guy. I like being the bad guy too. I it's enjoy dope. It. Like who cares? I'm getting asterisk shirts. I'm doing all that. Yeah, I'm Astros. Going all <laughs> asterisk. I like that. I'm going all the way. I feel like that. I like oh, the haters one. But the a H. villain is a good thing. Yeah. Like who? Everybody likes villains. Of course, the Joker. is the best character in Batman, and Batman's my favorite. Like Batman is book. a villain. Batman is a villain. Batman's crazy. He breaks the law because yeah. he has money. Yeah. If Batman was like a good guy, you know what he'd do? Pay for- He'd be a lawyer. It, well, no. He, <laughs> he'd pay for Arkham to get better security. That's true. He drops off a criminal every week, and the criminal breaks, breaks out. out like that night. Yeah. You don't slide some money. I mean, put some reinforced steel <laughs> on the bars. You're, you're right. Something they put all the be- and they put the best criminals in Gotham yeah. in the same spot. That doesn't make any sense. Plus, you say like like they talked about the reason why the criminals are there is because of Batman. Because they're like shit. Like there's this dude in a bat suit. He up Nigga, the game. we finna wear these costumes. He up the game. I finna put on a hat. Like, like, he, what do you like? Who does that? He, but he that like, there's black. a uniform. There's yeah. a uniform for criminals. Yes. That's ridiculous. He it doesn't make, why are you making this face at me? <laughs> <laughs> You're judging me. She's like, what, <laughs> what? did I get into? <laughs> Don't worry. We're going to get into just, just our thing. Oh, wait, we'll back it up. So he put on that black costume and yes, he was. <laughs> I like that. I Don't was, do the fist. To, I was trying to set you up. <laughs> I, I know you I was. was. It's so you corny, but, Here goes like, can, but no. fine. I'll just do it. Black and ugly as ever. I stay used and down to my socks. I don't have on socks today. I got on loafers. I'm adulting again. I'm an adult. I feel it once again. I am Avery, like a very nice guy, also known as Carlton Banks. Carlton with a K B A N triple X. Yep, that's me. It's me, Avery. And also, that's it's, new. I like that. It's 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 wrestling stuff. It's DDP. Oh, also, um, I'm my back in, I'm back into wrestling. I know. Yeah, Jake the Snake. Are you? Wait, no, it wasn't Jake the Snake. It was Jake the Snake. Jake the Snake. Yeah. He's old, but he's back. He's back to talk, but he's gone. He's not gonna wrestle. Huh? Nope, he's old. He's but old. my brother over there. Just Devon, Just Devon, one of the best writers I've ever met in my entire life. Looking up at the screen like an amateur. I know, but we are amateurs. What's waving, happening? What's waving, the deal? Waving at people in the studio <laughs> like an amateur. Matter. That's all right. That's we can do this. Right. This is Here our show. That's all right. You're we right. We produce this. We made it happen. Well, Mike produces it, but you know. I oh, yeah, it. Mike produces it. Like yeah. I'm <laughs> using the wrong term. Yeah, shout out to Mixmaster Mike. All right, so keeping in the mind of... um. What is it? It's Women's um, History Month. Women's History Month. Now, this is going to come out after Women's History Month, but this is Women's History this Month. This is during Women's History Respected. Month. Actually, we have a entrepreneur with us in the building. She is the owner of her own line, Lilith Official, with Lilith Erotica. She's also a model as well, Adeja Simone. Hello. Hello. 
How are you Hi, doing today? Good. Make some noise for David Woo! Simone. Yeah, I'm good. Yeah. I'm How's good. it going? How's it going? It's going right. okay. So you were asking how do we discover? And we were like, we were just looking at we we look at people that are like yeah. doing stuff in Houston. I was mm-hmm. like, oh, I said that is a business that we haven't, and we're gonna get to your business. That's yeah. Yeah, yeah, But yeah. we want to get we want to start off with the history of you and your relation to Houston, and you know, just work our way up. So, where are you from? I'm originally from Palm Springs, California. Palm Springs, California. Uh, I did a little time, not in jail, but <laughs> <laughs> Clarify. Uh, moved to Brooklyn, New York for a little bit. Yeah. Um, probably when I was maybe like five or six, moved down to Houston, and I've been here ever since. Oh, so you got here at five or six? Yeah. Oh, okay. I'm so Houston bred. So you, yeah, been, yeah, yeah, I'm about to say, you said Palm Springs, yeah, yeah but yeah, our it whole thing. Nice. Is, well, it does sound nice, but it's one of those things where also like you're pretty much where you're from, like middle school, like yeah. middle, like when you're five or six, you could say like he's from San Antonio. Yeah, I'm from Chicago. Yeah. But <laughs> it, bro, <laughs> wow, wow. Although she's right, yeah. But have you been? Corona, to Santa, have you, I just went to San Antonio with my ex. It remember, was boring, wasn't it? It was boring. It we was just, that the breakdown of the relationship. <laughs> yeah, because I rooted for the. Because uh, now y'all were stuck together, and y'all had to like. I was going for San Antonio Spurs. She was going for the Lakers, and I was like, "Fuck the Lakers." I well, I'm in, I am a Laker fan, but while I'm in San Antonio, that's I'm why you're from broke San Antonio. No, no. Oh, okay. I'm about to say. I'm about to we say. have a con- we have a podcast. Oh, okay. Content, okay. nigga. Okay, my bad, my bad, <laughs> my bad. But San Antonio, like, shouts out to y'all. People from San Antonio do listen, and I like y'all. I really do. Anyway, boring. <laughs> All right. So, so, uh, but yeah, wherever you're from in middle school, because when you're a kid, you can't get around. Like, that's where are you true. going? Like, five years old. Yeah. The only place you know is the inside of your house. That is true. Like, you can't. Where, what do you know about Palm Springs? Wait, you said Palm Springs? Mm-hmm. Palm Springs, California. Where, you know, it's where too. a lot of people go to retire. Yeah. It's the it's, it's the retired old people. capital. Yeah. That's where uh, the Fresh Prince and Carlton got arrested. First of all, Palm Springs, as a child, <laughs> I thought, because there were so many old people in Palm Springs that was in Florida. I thought it was in Florida, too. I thought Palm Springs was in Florida the whole time until the Fresh Prince of Carlton Will got arrested. Carlson got arrested yeah. there. Like, what, the Florida? Yeah. It's like, nah, they was just they down drove the street. There. They was down the street. And then you said you from there, Brooklyn? Yeah, my dad is uh, from Brooklyn, so we okay. lived there for a little bit. And then moved to Houston. I've been there ever since. What side of Houston? Um... Down the street from you, Rosenberg. Really? Yeah. Oh, Rosenberg. High five. Nah, man. <laughs> oh, what? Uh, you did that San Antonio. Wait, 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 wait. Did that San Antonio. I got you. You were living in Rosenberg, though. And shout out to our people that also live in Rosenberg, uh, a.k.a. Houston's San Antonio. Like, Rosenberg. <laughs> like, what does Rosenberg got going on? Nothing. Absolutely nothing. So here, it's New yeah. Sugarland now. They're de- they're building houses. It's, yeah, yeah, they are. They're expanding. Yeah. It's, they're it's, expanding. It's going places. Yeah, it is. This is that I was helping somebody move the other day. Um, my my mistake. Like, and I'm about a, to say how somebody got you to what? First of all, I forgot that this person is a full adult, and she got a group of us to move. Number and one, then I realized that she had a family. Yeah, and then I was like, oh, you're like a real adult. Like you have furniture. Like, uh, yeah, well, I'm like, we're old now. So, yeah, but we were driving out to the area, and there was a massive, like, massive, I thought it was, like, a complex. And then I'm looking, I'm like, that's a house. And that's the smallest house in this neighborhood. I forgot what the neighborhood was from, but it's like, I don't know, somebody rich lives there. And one of my homegirls, she bought her house out there. And really? I was like, oh, golly. It's a drive. When's the last time you went out to Rosenberg? That's where I just came from right now. Oh, you're still out in Rosenberg? Mm -hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay, we're not going to judge you too much. Okay. A little bit. No, we're judging. (laughs) (laughs) We're judging. (laughs) Okay, okay. So you're out in Rosenberg. All right, so uh, what high school did you go to? What schools? George Ranch High School. Oh, okay. George Ranch High School? That's what's up. Yeah. That high school is massive. Yeah, it was pretty cool. That's about a lot of You were out. You were out of George Ranch. What were you doing out there? We'll talk off mic. You know what? Okay, yeah, I know. That was like, back. what? <laughs> I was about to say. I'm saying, I don't know. I don't know what that was. I don't know what When that I was is. younger, yeah. Was like. So when you're in school, because you said you, you, you've you gone into modeling and eventually we're going to get into your your brand here. 
Uh, what were your plans like coming up? So I wanted to be a doctor. So these past few years, I've been a pre-med student and then I switched mm-hmm. over to a business major. And now I'm thinking about going into sex therapy. And I think it'll go hand in hand uh, with my business and sense. can go along that way. What made you decide to switch off the pre-med? I was tired of it. And I was like, you know what? I want to be an entrepreneur. I want my own business. I want direction. And I decided it was time for a change. And that's a lot. Like, I was going to do it. And yeah. I just realized I didn't like to see blood like that. Like, And it's really hard. It's Math, a, science, it's, it's, it's a lot. so oh, yeah. hard. He, Organic he, chemistry. He did the same. The Organic. anatomy, Organic the anatomy chemistry. is what killed like, what me. F- it was so hard. Yeah. Oh my Organic chemistry. Wait, our anatomy me. killed you? Yes. That's ironic. That's like you're trying to get it. No, it's like having you literally. You go in a classroom. It's different parts of the body on different tables, and you have to go and try to remember verbatim each individual part in the function of that part. So when we got to the brain, you're trying to memorize every single part of the brain. And it's uh, it medulla so oblongata. Hard. That's all I know. That's what everyone knows. <laughs> that's what I remember. I was going to drop that one next. The medulla oblongata. Yeah. Because it sounds like you know something when you say medulla oblongata. then people be like that one I thought movie. you were making a Kanye reference with that. It was in the song. Was it? Yeah. What's I haven't been listening. Man. What, the new album or the old? I think it was uh, one of his newest albums. Oh, that's why. He I made mean, a, I, a reference to <laughs> it. Yeah, I haven't did, listened like, to too much new Kanye. I was like, damn. She's born in what? Like 90 what? Like that's a, that's a, he made the reference from an older movie. Like I was like, I'm so old. I'm like, bruh, it was a, what's that Will Ferrell movie? I was like, yo. What Will Ferrell movie? He said Medulla album got it in it. No, we'll we're not doing later. this. We'll figure it out later. Waterboy. It wasn't, it was Adam Sandler. I was about to say, that's <laughs> Adam Sandler. Uh, okay. They look alike. Was Will Ferrell in there? I don't know. Yeah, we're just getting, we're doing white people look alike. We're, so. we're a white, that's a joke. That's a joke. I'm playing. We're doing that's what, white that's what do reverse it. racism feels we're doing like. What white people do when it comes to black. Yeah, I know. That's like, why oh, I did yeah. it. Adam Sandler. How you look like Sugar Will Ferrell. Yeah. I, I look like. What you don't look like. Ten different people that look nothing like each other. What? Uh, Shaq. Mm-hmm. The kids will be like, oh, Shaq, Suge Knight, Rick Ross. Uh, there was a guy from a Tide commercial. Mm-hmm. Uncle Phil, yeah, uh, um, <laughs> yeah. You look like the dude from uh, Black Man with a Beard. That's from Superstore. Oh, the, wheelchair. the guy from Superstore. Yeah. I was gonna go with him for Halloween, but I, then I was that. like, I felt like, like, because the wheelchair. Can I wear? Can I use the wheelchair? Yeah, it's kind I feel of like that's insensitive. Yeah. Also, if I won the competition and I stand up, I feel like people are gonna be like, <gasps> you. <laughs> yeah, I'm like, okay, <laughs> never mind, never that's mind. What's up. So you switched off from. Uh, uh, you're like, okay, I don't want to do the pre-med thing, but it's interesting because it's still led you along the path and you're going into entrepreneur and particularly you want to go into sex therapy? Yes. Okay, why that? I have an interest in it. I really, like, I'm that psychological person. Like, I'm the one who literally wants to play therapist when I'm with you. Okay. So I will sit here and analyze everything about you head to toe and just... Like, let's talk about your mom. Let's talk about your childhood issues. Let's talk about all these different things <laughs> to figure out who you are to your core. And then the sex side is for obvious reasons. Well, yeah, I have interest in that. And I think I'd be pretty bomb at it. So. And, the, and, and that like, so you just I mean, you're talking about when you're saying, oh, I want to lead into sex therapy. You're also like, I want to talk about uh, your your mental state mm-hmm. and how that's going to how it affects better it or affect. what problems you're having ah, and that type of thing. Okay, and then okay. maybe dip into marriage counseling, like something. I just want to go in a that type of route. Ah, okay, okay, that's good. And what got you? What, what, I mean, what leads you into that path? What got you interested in that? Just I was in a relationship, and um, that person led me down this path of erotica and sex and all those different things is and this 50 shades of great time yeah it is really? <laughs> is have this, you been to her website is this 50 i, I mean, have been to the clearly, website but i was like okay. clearly there's bondage on like, there i'm not gonna shade, lie to you yeah 50 shades of rosenberg yeah. wow. so this is 50 yes. shades of gray so you're in that what but i mean i i saw 50 shades of gray part one aren't there three of them i saw part one I don't know what happens yeah. along the path. <laughs> Why'd like, you stop? What happened? You know what? I uh, 
I don't know why I stopped. Oh, HBO didn't have the other two up. <laughs> It wasn't that I was like, oh, this is bad. I'm like, HBO just didn't have the other two up. Like, that was just pretty much oh, it. Oh, speaking of which, mom, stop listening from this point on. Oh, please. Stop. Oh, no, she's definitely going to listen. She's going to listen <laughs> all the time. But we're still, it's still going to be presented in a minute. Like, this is a, like, I think that's the other thing where it's, you're very upfront about the sexuality and you're also like, you know, I think that part of when you're talking about sex therapy, which is interesting, is you want to kind of take the stigma. Mm hmm out of sexuality like yeah. that that's a lot of people want to be honest with you i try to hide what i do like mm -hmm. meeting guys or talking to guys because they then from that point forward think it's just oh, all yeah. about like i'm just this super and it's it's a business it's a lifestyle how does and that affect though like <sighs> as soon as they find out then what happens well, this podcast is going man to it stuff. just it goes left. It's just how <laughs> their mind just the blood yeah. rushes. It's just it doesn't go. She said the blood rushes. The blood rushes. <laughs> <laughs> She's done. Mom, don't go to the website.